guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. So we got what looks like the best free-to-play unit in the game here. Um, LR Vegito Blue is easy. Um, he seems like a very effective character. We're going to take him into Red Zone Broly. Now, I think this is definitely going to work out very well. Uh, one of the major reasons being that the rest of the team is just ridiculous, right? Like, I mean, we could realistically put any character in Vegito's blue spot, including a Cyberman. And we're going to win pretty effortlessly, I would say, against this Broly fight with this team. Um, but I think Vegito Blue, you know, provided we get at least some okay-ish luck, Vegito Blue should be double-digit tanking Broly's normal attacks, which as an STR unit is all you can really ask for, right? I don't typically like to use STR units in the Broly fight because um, you're asking for trouble, but I, I think this Vegito Blue is good enough. Well, this does suck. I don't like this opening rotation here because I wanted to run... Zamasu and Goku Black and Zamasu as a rotation, right? Um, damn, this is very unfortunate. I, wow, yeah, th this sucks because I really wanted them. And we got Tech Gogeta in slot seven. This this run is going to get a little fraudulent. I would love to just reset because I just hate my rotation so much, but. Um, all right, so we can do this. He's going to get the 18 key. I'm going to go for the 18 key for Vegito Blue because that'll give us a better chance to build up his passive faster. Uh, Vegito Blue has a couple of links active right here. We have Fuse Fighter Prepare for Battle and Legendary Power activated. A little bit rough for Fusion Zamasu here, but it is what it is, right? Like, I, I don't want to push Vegito Blue off rotation. Uh, so what I'm going to try and do, I guess, is we're going to at least... Goku Black and Zamasu are built up instantaneously, which is good. But, I mean, this is no big bad bosses. We're going to take some damage and stuff here. Uh, you know, I, I didn't want to float Vegito Blue off. Because um, that, that would have been really bad. Um, you know, we need him to get the super attack. Because, remember, Vegito Blue opening is not the greatest. He needs to build up with, at, you know, the five super attacks to build up his passive. There's one. We got unlucky, of course. And then no additional hidden potentials of some attack. This is... Yeah, I mean, he, hey, he's... Tech VV in Namek Goku, like, he's the same type of character, right? For me, it's a super and then normals, man. That's all I get. Okay. Oh. It's just, this is where, you know, it's on global now, so you guys know. This is where the goddamn three... I, I'm just intentional. Well, I, I will give him the 18 key. Um, but this is where the damn three times per day is brutal. Because we I got basically the worst possible rotations I wanted. Um, cause like Goku Black and Zamasu need to be building up Vegito Blue. I don't want to float him off rotation and have him come back 80 turns later when he needs to build up as well, right? Like things kind of didn't, weren't in a good spot. And Tech Gogeta, preferably you want Tech Gogeta, um, in slot, uh, like turn four. The only way you can't make that happen is if he's in slot seven. And that's of course what we got. So we'll have to play around this. Um, we, we have a lot of options, a lot of horses on the team. Uh, who are going to work very effectively, though, right? Again, we got Vegeta and Trunks. We, we got Tech God Goku, of course, is a staple in this Broly fight. For the most part, we we should be pretty good here. I don't really think we have anything to be too concerned about. I think we would want Vegeta and Trunks to not finish Broly off here. At this point, because of how bad our opening rotations were, the slower we go, the better. Yep, perfect, nice. Um, Broly is... Don't triple super, please. Uh, but Broly is sealed. So, Vegito Blue, I think, would probably take a little damage in slot one. Calm down. God damn it. What are we at in terms of our defense? Ah, uh, this sucks. It's at 190, which is bad. I mean, we have no stacks in. And we only got one super attack last turn. We're going to eat some damage, some damage here. There's not much I could do about it. Yeah. Let's at least just get the super. God damn this game. And then we could set up Goku Black and Zamasu on the next rotation. Okay, hopefully this isn't too much. Uh, okay, we, we could deal with that. that. That's not at a point where it's going to prevent Tech Gogeta from transforming next turn. So again, we didn't get any stacks in so far. He didn't crit good. Nice. Okay, beautiful. That works out really well that he didn't finish right there. So now we get the additional super in right there. So now we've done three supers for his passive. He has to do five. We have a stack in. So now we're on track to be looking a lot better against... Um, Whatchamacallit, that guy, later on. EGL Broly. Yeah, we're looking good here. Nice, 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 nice. We'll just give Zamasu full key. Sure, whatever. Um, and then I do want to give God Goku full key as well. 
We should be good here. Yeah, this is fine. Okay, cool. So it looks like we could fuse with Tech Gogeta, get ourselves the Scouter. Remember, Vegito Blue, I think, should be able to tank um, normal attacks pretty easily from uh, EGL Broly. It's just the super will do a million damage, right? Like, it's like STR Kaioken Goku. If you guys watched when I took STR Kaioken Goku against Broly, Kaioken Goku was literally dancing the whole fight. Double super after double super, critting huge damage, double digit damage taken until you get to the end, and then Broly just hits him with a million damage, and we, we got one shot it, right? Um, by the way, don't sleep on Merge Zamasu. Ridiculous unit. This is no Big Bad Boss's active right here, and he still is ludicrous. Guaranteed double supers is actually just, like, beyond belief with its power. Oh, okay. Calm down. Um, sure. But now this becomes a thing where we want God Goku to finish Broly off right here, I think. Please, please crit or double super or something. Damn it. I'm... I'm not able to get any stacks in with VB. He's going to have a sliver of health. Nice, dude. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay, what is his defense looking like? 270. Okay, okay. We're getting there. Um, let's go ahead and uh, fuse into Tech Gogeta right here. This will help us out a lot. Um, having Oh, dude, this, this run has been so bad. The Vegeta and Trunks have gotten no stacks. Oh, we're in trouble. Alright, what are we looking like? No super attack. Is... Damn, if only I'd floated Vegeta and Trunks last turn, actually. That would have been such a smarter play by me, because then we could have done double Father, Son, Galak on next turn. Okay, so let's... Let's actually do that. We're, I, I want to set up for the Father, Son, Galak gun. Um... We, let, let's have VB super attack first. Yep, let's do that. Uh, we might take a little bit of damage right here, but we know that there's no super attack coming in, so we're good. Remember, he does link up reasonably well with Vegeta and Trunks. So this has actually been a pretty shitty run in terms of getting him his stacks. That's actually not too bad right there. 32? Only 32? Okay. Uh, remember that VB on his 18 key super attack, he does get 50% defense, right? And then... W wait, was that our fourth super? Or that's four, right? Four? Damn it. Dude, my brain... Um, we can't live this, right? I don't think we can live this. No, they're only at 330k. Vegeta and Trunks aren't in slot one. Let, let's just, uh, let's double weiss. Let, let's just get through AoE Broly, right? Um, I, we would not have been able to survive this because Goku Black and Zamasu had to float, so they weren't stacking a turn. Uh, Merge Zamasu has to super attack first. Vegeta and Trunks haven't really done too many attacks. Um, I am going to pop the Father Son Galakun right here. Let's just go ahead and do this and hopefully finish off this guy's health bar very fast. <laughs> Okay, um, so we should be looking pretty good now. How is our defensive numbers looking? Definitely better, definitely better. Okay, I think we probably could, uh... Pretty much one shot this guy now, right? I, do we? Does he die on this turn? I think it's close. Depending upon what Fusion Zamasu does, like Broly could be dead right here. Um, Goku Black and Zamasu, their defense is a bit, a little bit lower than usual, but that's because we had floated them, right? Yeah, again, uh, our opening rotations were pretty bad. I had to force my hand in certain ways. Um, we have the double E up though, so we should be good on all these characters. All right, oh, Vegeta and Trunks, they're still guarding, huh? Maybe I, I think I could have lived Broly's super attack then. If I put Fusion Zamasu first, 
Ah, it would have been close. Because Goku Black and Saucer, they only had 300k defense. So they would have eaten 500k damage. Nah, we couldn't have lived. They would have eaten 500k. And it's like Fusion Zamasu still would have taken a little bit of damage. Right? Vegeta and Trunks would have taken a little bit of damage. Um, that rotation could have lived. Um, if... Uh, whatchamacallit? Uh, if I hadn't had to float Goku Black and Zamasu. Right? Because remember, they... When they... Besides their buildup they have... They also get um, the super attack effects for multiple turns. And floating really, like, throws that off. Alright, so we're not going to finish Broly off right here, it looks like. That's okay. Um, th this was one of these showcase runs, though, where every single turn, Vegito Blue shows up, and this is how much health the enemy has. Like, I haven't even had a chance to, like, super with him. Um, Let's do this. Can I? I can. We get just... Force a 12 key super attack out. I feel like there's no reason not to do this, actually. Let's just go for the 12 key super. We can do this. Get a stack in. VB, unless he double super, double crits, is not going to finish. I'll do this to get us closer to the Dokkan attack. Remember, we still have our Whis up right now. So we should be good. I would love VB to double super without critting. I think Broly would then have a sliver of health left, probably. Oh, okay. Or he just, okay, here are your crits. Sure. <laughs> Whatever. Um, does Fusion's monster have his active skill here? Oh. I mean, we're fine. I, I could just... Yeah, we live. Like, that's not that's not an issue. Zamasu lives that. He tanks that easy. Alright, so we don't have to worry about Zamasu dying. He can tank Broly's super attack right here. This will lower our health quite a bit, though, so we do want to be careful of that. Um, let's just make sure that Zamasu, yeah, gets his 18 key super attack. I don't have to give him all the 18 key supers, or all the, all the int orbs, but we can. Gogeta with his, um, thing up will be fine as well. Uh, we do, I did bring the Kakarot support memory also, right? So Gogeta's getting the buff from that. This is why Zamasu is so dumb, right? Is that, like, a turn like this, most characters in the game, it's like, oh, uh-oh, but it's like, Zamasu could take this. We will take a lot of damage, but it's okay. We'll, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Especially if Zamasu triple supers, we're, like, totally A-okay. Uh, was the super attack the first hit he's doing, though? It is. Okay, so we're not going to be able to build up any of his extra damage reduction. That's a bit unfortunate, but I'm not really too concerned. This is not going to kill us. And Tech OG is not going to take damage. We did triple super attack. Beautiful. Um, I think we'll probably take 400k at max. I'm not too sure, because remember, he's got the sort of, like, moving up. Oh, we did get one hit in. Nice. Okay. So that's an extra bit of damage reduction. I think this will be, like, 350. Like, 320 to 350 to 370 in that range, I think. Okay. Let me, let me stop disrespecting this, man. That's insane. Like, that's... Okay. That's new. That's insane. Broly does 1.2 million damage, man. That's just so crazy. 260? Like, that's not even half our health. Like, look at this. That's so nuts. Oh, Gogeta. Whoa, buddy. With the support memory? Calm down. Okay. Um. We could do the father-son Gallic gun right here. Oh, no, 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 no. We gotta do this. Um. Oh, my God. He's at 363. Yeah, he's double digit tanking. I think even... Even without the Father Son Gallic Gun, he's. I'm not gonna use the Father Son Gallic Gun right here just so I can prove to y'all that he doesn't need it for the double digit tanking. I think it's actually probably pretty important that I don't do that. Oh, wait, but they're. No, they're at 234. No, I. I have to do this. They're, they'll get their. Because they're gonna get hits. Well, no, there's no, su there's no super attack back there. They're not built up, right? Is the reason they're so low. Yeah. I, I, I think I could do this. Uh, dude, I kind of... Uh, I want VB to take these hits without the Father Son Gallic Gun, but I'm actually a little bit nervous about this Vegeta and Trunks right here. But the reason they're so low... I'm gonna... Dude, he does... I guess we could just die. Like, I, I, we, we could just leave it exactly like this. I could just die. Like, it's not a big deal, right? Okay, so let's do this. Yep. We can hit this. 
And then at least we will get the 18 key with them. Um, I Vegito is easily double digit tank. I think just just with the 18 key, we should be good. Um, if he double supers a thousand million hundred trillion percent, we're good. Um, Vegeta and Trunks at the end. I I might be worrying too much about them because we know that there's no super attack back there. But I, I just haven't. They haven't. I think they haven't built up their passive right. They get hit and they build up their defense and their crit chance. And I think they haven't been hit enough. Them double supering right here is really good to lower the damage from Broly's super uh, that this one is going to eat. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we're completely good to go. Okay. I'm worrying too much. I'm too conservative against Broly. Uh, Broly does a lot of damage. Uh, you know, shocking. Stunning. All right. Easy. Uh, this is not much at all, right? Just a little bit of damage here. Let's see. Yeah. Nice damage, dude. Okay, VB, please give us a double super. Double super, and I guarantee we're at double digit damage. Okay, nice. Yeah, we're, we're, we're cooling. Very good, very good. Yeah, I, I don't have an issue. Oh, I was, he did take 57 right there. Hmm. All right. I mean, how many supers? We had his passive fully built up. I, I mean, I definitely could have gotten way more 12 key supers in throughout the fight. I feel like when I've seen physical Ginyu a lot of times, that unit has taken, like, a similar amount of damage. We could have done that. I mean, if I had popped the Father-Son Gallop gun, like, yeah, we're tanking. But that's that was, like, such... That'd be such a... Oh, they are taking a lot of damage. Okay. Yeah, passive wasn't built up. Hmm. I... It's like, could I have played this better? How many stacks did Vegito get? Did he have... Was it only two? Two 12 key stacks, and he took 57 from Broly. I really would have liked double digits right there. I mean, you easily could, th th but this is, this is we go back to like the the Namek Goku thing, right? Where it's like, oh, if he triple supers every single turn, he's great. Same thing with Vegito Blue. I think Vegito Blue, like comparing him on the level of free to play characters, he's very good. Um, I think Vegito Blue, Physical Ginyu, and Tech Ginyu are characters you could bring into like all these red zone fights, right? Because remember, this is the strongest AGL boss in the game. Vegito at 57k, it's not that bad, considering I think we have bad luck. You could easily get him to take double-digit damage from that guy, for sure. Um, I just have, you know, pretty terrible luck, typically. Uh, I could do this. We we win. Yeah, th th this is over. This is GG. Oh, that didn't go the way I wanted it to, actually. Damn it. Well, that's a dope kind of... We're okay. Whatever, man. Whatever, whatever. I don't care. We, we could die. Who cares? I could just reset the app right there to guarantee Fusion's monster gets the 18 key, but who cares? We're, we're fine. Not a big deal. All right, so let me know what you guys think of LR, STR, Vegito Blue. Um, overall, I'd say we, I feel like we got poor luck. Because remember, his additional super is... Um, what do you call it? Uh, it's a, his additional super is a 50% chance to occur. So you could get that the coin flip to land correct for you every single time and he looks great. Or it could not every single time and it doesn't go good. Right, like, if we had had a bunch of these turns where Vegito was able to, like, you know, get multiple stacks in every turn rather than every single run, like, the enemy had, like, a little bit of health. Well, are you, dude, are you kidding me? Come on. All right, we did. We, we're, we died. <laughs> I, I could have reset the app to give Fusion to Monster an 18 key super. Well, whatever, man. Sure. Have fun. <laughs> Knock yourself out, Broly. <laughs> okay, dude. Sure. <laughs> whatever. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Uh, VB. Definitely very good, right? Um, yeah, okay. Thanks. I got it. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I, I, I see the, the 600k damage we ate. So VB, right? That was the toughest AGL boss in the game. If we had had better luck, he could have been able to d double digit tank. Um, but again, it's, you know, name it Goku, tech VB, school. It's like you could have these characters go crazy or they could be bad. This is a little bit of a reason. Typically, the people I see hate on, like, AGL UI Goku are the same people who go crazy for, like, Namek Goku and stuff like that. When they also... UI Goku needs RNG for his defense, his dodges to proc. Like, Namek Goku needs RNG for his additional supers. This guy does. Tech VB does, right? So it's just that type of unit. Um, I would say I probably feel a little bit more comfortable with this guy on the team compared to Tech Vegito Blue, though. I feel like Tech Vegito Blue struggles for key massively. This guy does not, right? 
with Vegeta and Trunks, we had Super Saiyan, Shattering Limit, and, um, no, uh, Super Saiyan, Prepare for Battle, and Legendary Power activated. He is definitely good. One thing to keep in mind is he took that damage from Broly, and I did have the full defensive, uh, equip set up on him, right? 1,500 defense, uh, we had 1,000 defense from Silver, and then we had 500 defense from Bronze. So we had the full defensive build right there. We just didn't get a lot of additional supers to allow him to double digit tank Broly, which he can do, right? So let me know what you guys think of EZA LRSTR Vegito Blue against Dragon Ball Super Broly. Thanks guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.